Hi, this tutorial is for Code.org Course F Lesson 4, Steps 8 through 11. Okay, for this challenge, I'm asked to create a star by looping a sequence of move forward and turn right by 144 degree blocks. So what I know about a star is that it has five lines. One, two, three, four, five. So I'm going to pull out my repeat block and I'm going to change the value of the repeat block to five. Now up in the instructions, I was given some important information about the turn I need to make, but I do need to move forward first to draw the line. And the number of pixels is already set for me. Next, I'm going to be turning right 144 degrees. And I'm going to do this five times. Let's run and see if it works. All right, let's move on to step nine. Okay, for step nine, I'm going to be making some a staircase. And in the instructions, it's telling me I need to use a loop, which is a repeat block, so let's pull that up. It's also giving me some important information about each stair step, that the step is 50 pixels long, 50 pixels tall, so all the lines will be 50 pixels, and that I will need to turn 90 degrees in each direction. So if I look at my sprite, I'm going to go forward, turn right, forward, turn left. So it's a right turn. If I turned right again, it would be a square. So it's actually a turn right. And if the sprite is facing down, you have to imagine that the left, even though on the screen it looks like it's a right turn, it's from the perspective of the sprite. The sprite would be turning left. So there's a pattern happening here. Forward right, forward left, forward right, forward left, forward right, forward left or right doesn't matter once you get to the end, but the pattern in the loop does matter. So we know we're moving forward 50, right by 90, forward 50, and don't forget, it's a left by 90. If it's all right turns, you have a square. So let's run. And there you go. Let's continue to puzzle nine. I'm sorry, 10. Okay, I'm gonna press start over here. Oh no, I don't need to do that. Okay, so this is the code from puzzle nine. And it's just asking you to use the same code but make a bigger staircase. So if this is the same code of making the staircase, move forward, turn right, move forward, turn left, three times. Well, if it's a bigger staircase, I'm just gonna change the value of the loop block. So how many times do I have to repeat that pattern? Let's see. Each step is one. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm going to just, all I have to do, Change the value, make a bigger staircase. There you go. Completed 10. Let's do the last one. All right, so this is overwhelming at first, but when you read the directions, it says look for a pattern and make this code shorter using loops. That's the whole point of using a loop, so that you don't have to have such a long um, bunch of code. So when I look over here at the shape, I do see a pattern because this is a regular polygon and it's actually an octagon because it has eight sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now inside the code that already exists, it's telling me to move forward 80 pixels. So I'm gonna keep that and turn right by 45 degrees. Great. Now I could actually take out all the rest and 
know that this is going to be repeated. Move forward, turn right by 45 degrees, move forward, turn right, and I'm going to repeat it eight times. So I have to take my loop block out, change the value to an eight because it's an octagon. And then what do I want to repeat eight times is the move forward, turn right. So all of this other code is unnecessary because I can use a loop block. That's it. All right, there you go. Good luck.